Hey guys, Soleno here from PlayToEarn.net. Another month is here, and as we welcome February after what seemed like forever in January, blockchain gaming projects have some surprises for us as well. In today's video, I'll be talking about five games that have stuff going on this month that you can keep your eye on. Without further ado, let's get to the list. The first game on our list is Echoes of Empire. Echoes of Empire is a sci-fi space strategy game being built by Gala Games. Echoes of Empire is a Web3 space MMO game that lets players explore, trade, and fight in a vast universe. In this game, you can own in-game assets such as ships, blueprints, celestial objects, and more, which are minted on Gala Chain and can be traded or upgraded. You can generate and consume resources such as ore, vapor, and composite, which are used for crafting, trading, and progressing in the game. Resources can also be harvested from mines on celestial objects or salvaged from old ships. You can engage in strategic combat and participate in battles with enemy fleets using different types of ships and technologies from three galactic factions. Combat can take place at home bases, celestial objects, or other locations in future updates. You can also participate in narrative-driven missions and discover new celestial objects and secrets in the galaxy. Some celestial objects can be claimed for ownership using celestial claim tokens, which grant access to resources, services, and strategic advantages. There is also a chance of earning Stardust while playing, which is a special token that can be obtained by harvesting mines on celestial objects owned by other players. Stardust can be converted to Gala, the native token of Gala Games, which can be used to purchase items or claim rewards. Just last January 31st, the game went live and is now playable on Windows through the Gala Games launcher. If you've been waiting for the release of Echoes of Empire or just wanted to try out a new 4X strategy game, the timing couldn't be better. They also published their light paper along with their launch. For more info, you can check out our article. The next game on our list is Arc 8. Arc 8 is a casual arcade minigame platform being built on Polygon. Arc 8 offers a variety of high engagement, skill-based casual games that you can play on your smartphone. There are 10 games available right now, ranging from arcade classics like Globo Run and 2048, to sports games like Hoop Shot and Manchester City Striker, to card games like Pirate Solitaire and Samurai Hold'em. You can see the full list of games on their website. The best part is you can play these games in one-on-one -on -one matches or group tournaments and win GME tokens as prizes. GME is the utility token of GAMI used to pay for entry fees in game tournaments and to make purchases on the platform. GME is also designed for governance functions, meaning that you can use it to vote on GAMI roadmaps, game deployment, and the distribution of prize and rewards pools. You can challenge others, compete in tournaments, and rise up the ranks based on your high scores. You can be the ultimate gaming champion, beat your opponents, and grow your beastie like no one else can. The better the food you earn, the more unique your monster will be. Arc 8 also brings you exclusive rewards and events like the Battle Pass to make your gaming journey even more rewarding. You can also participate in lucky events where you can win more rewards. You can join for free just by collecting luck while playing. Arc 8 recently launched the highly anticipated Arc 8 Retro Season. Running from January 31st to April 10th, this exciting event promises a nostalgic celebration of the 80s and 90s, complete with iconic styles, delectable treats, and exhilarating events. Some new inclusions to this event include new beast body shapes, a cranky monkey upgrade, beast utility boots, and more. There will also be a Valentine's event, partner events, and lucky events in store. For more info, you can check our article. Liking this list so far? Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to our channel so you're always updated with games that you love. Now let's get straight back to the list. The next game on our list is RebelBot Soil Wars. RebelBot Soil Wars is a PvP card game being built on Polygon. Soil Wars is a digital collectible card battle game where you get to build fierce teams of fighting robots in your home base, defeat other teams in epic card battles, and earn NFT and crypto rewards. The game adopts battle card strategy mechanics similar to games like Axie Infinity, so a lot of players can quickly learn how to play and start earning. You can master the art of battle and craft your strategy from over 300 lethal cards to create an unbeatable deck. You can also design and build your high caliber army of fighting bots from over 70 mechanical parts and three combat ready classes to arm yourself for victory. There are the industrial bots, which are built to withstand the most devastating attacks and keep on fighting. They are the tanks of your team. The military bots are armed with high powered attacks and can deal massive damage. And engineer bots are programmed as master tacticians these bots can provide life-saving support to allies or scramble your opponent's software. 
It's up to you to utilize these three classes along with the battle cards at your disposal to win every match and have a chance to earn even more rewards. The rental system just recently launched in RebelBots, enabling public and private renting of battle sets consisting of one land in FT and three fighting bot NFTs. This allows new players to enjoy the game and share rewards with lenders. The system features both public and private renting. This gives holders freedom to choose whether they'd like to allow anyone to rent their assets from the marketplace, or if they'd like to reserve their battle set for a particular person. For more info, you can check our article. The next game on our list is NFL Rivals. NFL Rivals is an action sports strategy game being built on the Binance Smart Chain. NFL Rivals is a game where you can own your dream team and guide your superstars to the end zone as you make history as the greatest NFL general manager of all time. As a general manager of your own NFL team, you can customize it with your favorite players. You can also control the actions of your players on the field and score touchdowns to win games. You can claim victory over your rivals through arcade-style football gameplay. The game has a fast-paced and fun style of football gameplay that is easy to learn and play. You can use various skills and strategies to outsmart and overpower your opponents. The game has dynamic and engaging content that changes with the real NFL seasons and events. You can participate in different challenges and tournaments to earn rewards and rank up in the leaderboards while leaving your other rivals in the dust. Since it is powered by blockchain, the game has a unique feature of digital collectibles that represent the NFL players. You can unlock these collectibles by playing a game and use them to improve your team's performance and appearance. In celebration of the Super Bowl, blockchain gaming company Mythical Games has announced the launch of a new program last February 1st in their officially licensed arcade-style sports game, NFL Rivals. The Super Bowl program will run from February 1st to February 29th, during which players will be able to earn a new program currency called Rings. This currency will be used to gain exclusive prizes, among which is a mythical card dedicated to the recipient of the Super Bowl MVP award. For more info, you can check out our article. The last game on our list is Crop Bites. Crop Bites is a building simulation strategy game being built on Polygon. Crop Bites is a simulation game that lets you become a farmer in crypto world. The game has a variety of assets that you can own and use. There are crop lands where you can grow different crops and fruits, such as corn, carrots, and apples. There are also animals such as cows and chicken that produce milk, eggs, and wool. There are utility assets such as water tanks, solar panels, and windmills that produce water and power. There are also special assets such as superheroes that have unique abilities and benefits. The main game loop revolves around growing crops and fruits on your farm. You can also tend to your animals if you have any, and you can also buy and sell the resources you produce to other players in the market. The game has a dynamic economy, where the prices of assets and resources are determined by supply and demand. You can trade your assets and resources for CBX, the native token of the game, or for other cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, Ethereum, Tron, and USDT. You can also use CBX to buy more assets and resources, or to upgrade your assets and unlock new features. The game also has a mining feature, where you can mine CBX by using your assets and resources. You can convert your extracts such as milk, eggs, wool, and manure into CBX using extractors. You can also convert your utilities such as water and power to CBX using converters. The more assets and resources you have, the more CBX you can mine. If you are interested in playing Crop Bites, you can check out their website or download their app. You can also follow them on their social media for the latest updates. The developers of Crop Bites have announced a new PvP world building game called Crop Bites Conquest. Crop Bites Conquest aims to combine strategic one versus one PvP battles with world building gameplay that includes taking care of your own biomes. While no specific release date is available, what is known, however, is that the game will launch into two phases. The first phase will focus on PvP and allow you to earn essence points, which you'll need for phase two when the world building aspect launches. For the first phase, an admin from the game's official Discord server, who goes by the name Brother Mint T, has revealed that this PvP focus paid release will take place at some point in February. For more info, you can check our article. And that's a wrap for today's list of games. If you are on the lookout for games that have stuff going on this February, I hope this video helped. And for more info on everything about blockchain games, check out our website at playedearn.net, where we have the largest database of games that have all the info you need. That's it for today. See you next video.